Okay, so for the fourth example, motors A and B, we have two motors, drawing the cable with the acceleration shown. Motor B is 2 feet per second squared and motor A is 3 feet per second squared. The question is the acceleration of the 300 pound crate C and the tension developed in the cable. Neglect the mass of the pulleys. So, um, okay, first is, of course, the given. Uh -huh. The mass of the crate C is 300 pounds. And the acceleration for motor B, AB, is 2 feet per second squared. For AA, is... 3 feet per second squared. So that's it for the given except for the FPD diagram. For the required, uh, the required is the acceleration of C and the tension developed in the cable. So we have how many cable? There's only one cable, so we have only one T. Now let's go to solution. But of course, we need to draw. An FBD diagram. Diagram. So this is again uh, in relation to kinematic kinematics of constrained motion. So we need still to apply the procedures in that uh, uh, kinematic analysis. So first we need to make an FBD of the C. So if this is the black C, we have the weight of the C, and we have two tension. Oh, I guess there are uh, how many tensions? It is still one, because the assumption is that the, 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 the tension is evenly distributed along the length of the rope. So this is still uh, T and still is T. Even though they, uh, the motor at B and the motor at A have different accelerations. Alright, so for kinematic analysis, let's draw the datum line at the top. And for uh, convenience, let's uh, cut the, the the cable. Let's say the cable is only somewhere there. Okay, to in order for us to draw the the position of B. And the position A so that we can formulate an equation for length equation. So for length equation we have uh, another one, we have a C. Let's see. Yeah. So for the length equation we have S B plus two S C plus S A. Of course, the rope, of course, we have the action. This is equals to length. So for the velocity, we have uh, VB plus 2VC plus VA equals 0. For the acceleration, AB 2AC plus AA equals to 0. We have AB, we have AA, so we can solve for AC. So 2AC, AC is equals to um, negative AA and negative AB divided by 2. So negative uh, AA is 3 feet per second squared, AB is 2 feet per second squared divided by 2. So AC is... 5 to negative 2.5 feet per second squared. 
so negative again it doesn't mean deceleration okay in this case it just means going upward because sc because vc i mean vc uh, which is negative means upward so they have the same sense they have the same sense meaning it is acceleration so negative 2.5 feet per second sorry. so that's for the acceleration determine the acceleration so the answer is ac 2.5 feet per second squared upward that's the final answer what about for the tension so for the tension of course we have to formulate the equation, the equation of motion yeah, uh, since it is going upward so we have summation of fy is equals to may so what are the forces that act along the y we have 2t minus the weight of the rate is equals to m a c so what are the tensions m c a c plus w c so the tension is equals to the mass of the c which is 300 pound crate 300 pound the acceleration is feet per second squared we need to convert the pound into slug so 32.2 pound slug this is mass by the way by the way the pound in as force is numerically equal to pound in mass so whether you treat the pound as force or as mass you are correct because if you convert pound force into pound mass the numerical value would still be the same that's why in most of the problems pound is not specifically defined whether it is a force or a mass because whether you take it as mass or a force you are still correct so now we're just converting it uh, i treat it as a mass and i convert it to slug so that if it will be multiplied with ac which is 2.5 uh, feet per second squared all of this will result to pound force and of course the weight c is 300 pound and this i will treat as force so force here force here they can be added so the final answer the final tension 300 divided by 2.2 times 2.5 plus 300 uh, all over 2 is 161 160 1.65 all right that's it